Once you start Discovery, you will be greeted with a new and improved welcome screen that first shows you what's new in the release, like the Check Geometry Tool's new and exciting automated repair capability. Next, you can get a quick video overview of Discovery's different stages, UI elements, mouse and keyboard shortcuts, and how to use both the geometry and simulation tools. At the end, there are interactive tours. You can turn off the welcome screen or go to the new homepage. The new homepage gives you access to recent files, sample models with simulations set up that require the Discovery Simulation license, file operations, access to the welcome screen, and additional learning resources, both on external ANSYS learning sites, but also integrated as interactive tours. Let's take a look at the one for model preparation. The interactive tours take advantage of Discovery's new overlay help. In the upper right, you can navigate to the next step where the learning model is automatically loaded for you. You are able to interact with the model while simultaneously being guided by Discovery's overlay help. Some pages include text, images, or videos, and will spotlight the tools that are needed for that step. There are interactive tours for modeling, preparation, and all the Discovery simulation capabilities. If we exit out of the tour, we can immediately go right back into the interactive overlay help with the question mark in the upper right or F1 on our keyboard. Immediately, it gives us an overview of the new UI where we can hover over tools for more information. In some areas, we can click to learn more or click links to load more detailed pages in the online help. I can exit out of Discovery Help with Escape or the X. If I have a question while using a tool, I can click the question mark in the upper right or press F1 for more help to go directly into the overlay help page for that tool. These are similar to the interactive tour, but usually with more information. You can use keyboard shortcuts to switch tools without exiting. And if you switch the function of a tool, Discovery Help provides the appropriate guidance.